I would like to welcome you. My name is Andreas Ruschok and I'm located in the University College Cork. This talk is about the SFI Frontiers for the Future project on Shortcut Enhanced Quantum Thermodynamics. This is a common project together with my colleague John Gould in Trinity College Dublin. If technology development, for example in microchips, is reaching smaller and smaller scales, then particles as electrons start to behave completely different from daily life experience. Everything must be then described by quantum physics. However, one can also take advantage of this strange behavior of the particles. And this leads to new technologies called quantum technologies. Subfields of quantum technologies are quantum simulation, quantum metrology, and quantum computing. Especially, there's also the field of quantum thermodynamics. Thermodynamics is a theory which was historically essential for the development of steam engines, and is also important for car engines. Now the interesting question is how thermodynamics can be applied to quantum theory. There has been already work in this direction, for example, by John Gould. But for all these quantum technologies, it is obviously essential that one is able to prepare, control, and manipulate quantum states with high fidelity, which means nearly perfect, and also in a fast and especially also robust way. Because there's always, for example, the problem of decoherence originating from the environment. One set of techniques for such a quantum control are shortcuts to adiabaticity, or in short, STA. Shortcuts to adiabaticity have been introduced in 2010 in this paper by myself and colleagues. Since then, the field has increased a lot, and currently many international groups are working on them. Shortcuts to adiabaticity are motivated by adiabatic processes, and by using STA, we can design analytically derived schemes for the control of quantum systems. Here you can see two reviews on shortcuts to adiabaticity. The goal of this SFI project is now to merge STA with quantum thermodynamics. The potential of this merging is nearly self-explaining, because ideal thermodynamic processes are based on adiabatic processes, which unfortunately require infinite operation time. On the other hand, STA offers techniques to speed up adiabatic processes. Therefore, this merging will allow to design new routes for solving current challenges in the field of quantum technologies. The first goal is now to design control schemes for quantum systems where up to now SDA techniques could not be applied to directly. A step in this direction is a new technique called enhanced shortcuts to adiabaticity. Its basic idea is to merge STA techniques with ideas from numerical optimal control, especially from the grape algorithm. The basic formalism of enhanced STA has been developed in this first publication here. However, for any practical application of the design quantum control scheme, it is important that the robustness has also been studied and optimized. Because of this, we have exactly done this, a study of the robustness of enhanced STA in detail in this second publication here. In the meantime, enhanced STA has already applied to several systems, by my own group and also by the group of Vladimir Stokhanovich. In addition to the development of enhanced STA, we have also introduced and examined a new, new quantum Stirling heat engine. It is based on a Bose-Einstein condensate with Zeeman and spin-orbit coupling, as well as magnetized and demagnetized media, which plays a role of the reservoirs. More details on this can be found in the shown publication here. Next step will be, for example, then a more detailed study of the thermodynamic costs, an extension of the enhanced SDA to open system, and a speed off of cyclic quantum heat engine using enhanced STA. If you would like to know more about the research of this SFI project, please have a look at the shown link. With this, I would like to thank you for your attention.